Hello guys, welcome back, and we're going to be doing a Don't Starve Together playthrough. I've never done this, I rarely play Don't Starve, but my brother Vance, he's a pro. So he's going to show me, and we're going to hopefully be able to kill every single boss in the game. And I don't know a name of a single boss, so I'm a noob. Um, he's going to have to carry me. So let's get started. Alright, first off, a few things I'm changing is disease and wildfire disease shouldn't be that big of a deal because this is probably not a long-term world and wildfires uh i might keep it on or off i don't know i'm definitely adding caves and besides disease and wildfires everything is normal I'm going to enable a few mods. I don't really consider them cheating. You might then. I'll just show you a rundown of what I have. I have action queue, combined status, nightmare HUD, which is literally just, it changes the looks of your inventory. So I'm going to disable this. And Geometric placement, a must-have. Gesture reel, just makes emotes easier. Minimap, this is questionable. I've gotten used to it. I probably shouldn't use it. So I guess I will go without it in this world. And quick drop, it just helped. Like, you can hold shift on an item to drop it. I can disable smart crockpot because I know like all of the recipes now and this just shows other people like if you need a certain material to build something I don't know it's a really useful mod you'll see me use it as for server mods I I think I will do global positions so me and him can always know where we are and that should be good. Sorry for the long intro. Um, so we're disabling minimap? Yes. I just pressed apply. I think it's restarting. Alright, let's... Are, are you making the game? I will add a description and we are good to go. You should Thanks. be able to see the world now. Is it called YouTube World? Yeah. What character do you want me to be? Well, my personal favorite is Wolfgang. Double damage when he's mighty. I would probably recommend Wilson because his beard is actually... I underestimate his usefulness for Winter. And he's a, real, he's a pretty good starting character. He's like literally... The only def he's like the default character. Everyone else has perks and quirks, I think. That's how you say it. Alright, well I'll be I'll be Wilson. And I will be Wolfgang. If there's any skins you want to put on, you can do it now. If not, let's go. Are you in? I just launched. Oh, I don't have any pants or shoes for him, but I have a weird like a red scar on his face. Alright, I'm going in. How the heck did you get that skin? For your head? I don't know. If you get if you check the map, you can see we explore for each other. So we it'll take oh, a little less time to explore the do? world. 
Oh, there's a bunch of beehives. Holy crap. With a bunch of grass around it. That's like a set piece. It's like... It's a area that is... Saved in the game and... There's like loads of set pieces that can randomly be put around the world. That's just like skeletons. You can get a walking cane from a skeleton. It's insane. What I like to do in my first days is explore the map completely. Or at least around the edges. I do know you don't want to pick up flowers, right? Yeah, you can leave them for butterflies. You get 8 health and a bit of hunger, which is like a berry and a spider gland combined. Which is very good. If you ever pass those statues that say suspicious marble, then build a trap and place it right next to it so it has a map marker. Okay, why why would we do that? Like, what is the use in it? So, so that is an item we would need for a certain boss fight called Shadow Pieces. It's three bosses, and you have to do that on a certain night, which we hopefully can do by the first time that hits, which would be day 21, a new moon, but that's going to be kind of a challenge. You can always know when a full moon and new moon will be just by looking at the day count, and I'm pretty sure Helicopuma or Don Gianni have made videos on that, so go check them out. I, I should not be finishing off spider dens, right? Oh no, go ahead. You can okay. do that. Do you have two grass and two twigs to make a torch? Yeah, I already made one. Okay, good. We could take down a boss called Dragonfly pretty early game. And that would benefit us so good. You what? get a scaled furnace, which is basically a, an endless fire pit that you can cook anything on, and it's very good for winter because it's very warm. That is probably our goal for the first 20 days, and also keep on the lookout for those heads so we can do the shadow fight, because our goal in this world is to kill all the bosses. I found, um, I just found like woods with some pig houses and a spider dens. Isn't that like a biome that spawns? Well, that's in every world. That's just the deep forest. Or oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking Yeah. It's something in every world, but yeah. We will be hammering all the pig houses we find because pig skin is invaluable. Oh, you want me to hammer them? If you have rocks, grass, and twigs, and you can make a hammer, then you can. Do you need like a science machine to get it first? No. I just found. I. I mean, I just found some rock, and I'm gonna about to hit them. Hit their uh, pig houses down. Alright, sweet. Are they getting mad at me? Nope. They're stupid. Or not yet, I can almost. I found also found a bunch of beefalo. Alright, good. I just broke his house while he was in there and he did nothing. Yep, they don't care. Which they really should. And I just found an elephant. And if I look on the map, we do not have too much to explore. The fight tab and make a pop on helmet. So you need to come to this machine to make your football helmet. And now we can also make our hand back. My beard's grown a little long. Goody goody. Oh, 
Alright. I'm thinking right in this wooded area near us should be a good place to base. First, we should probably clear these killer bees, which I can clear them very good by one-shotting them with a mighty. A good way to fight them is to sidestep and then swing. Especially when... I'll go for the main course. Wow, not hit even once. Now in single player, that would be a very different scenario. Because single player bees are very, have like a ridiculous amount of range and they attack, they are very hard. You will die if you run into a horde like that. Okay, so we've cleared that, and I'm just going to show, oh, I guess I hammered that, but a great reason to have things prototyped is so that you can just place them all down. Right there, and then we'll have a bird, bird cage. I guess off to the side. Oh dear. Some people dig up blue caps, which it's a good method, but I like just going straight for Perogi. So. Especially for a boss like Dragonfly. And I'll clear a few of these spider dens that are in this area. Now we have an alchem alchemy engine, and I'll put that right here. Sorry if base is not looking too good, but we may, look, we may make it look pretty good. Oh, but yeah, I'm gonna probably head back now. So right now, we're going to be needing lots of rocks to build the wall. And also, I'm going to set a trap out at our base. And I'm actually, I'm gonna be gone for a little bit, so if you see a bird in the trap, put it in the cage. Okay. Oh dear, do you need help? No, they're killing Chester though. Why are they going for Chester? They de aggroed off of you, and he was the closest uh, mob. There we go. 
more meat. And besides, he has loads to health, and he regenerates it, so it's not too big of a deal. I'm just going to do a four... A four crock pot kitchen. Nothing too fancy. Off of. Ooh, a bunny man. He has got to go. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, now go to the seafaring tab. Like, it looks like a, a I see it. steering wheel. The very first thing, a boat kit, make that. Alright. Now come over here. Perfect. Sweet. All right, thanks guys for watching. We're we're this is days one through ten. We're gonna have days uh, ten through twenty coming out soon, and hopefully we're gonna kill a uh, flying a dragonfly, fire dragonfly or something. I don't know what it's called. Um, so tune in next time. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. See ya.